Today, a registered nurse in Queens received the first coronavirus vaccine shot during a news conference. Dr. Dorian joins me right now. When are you getting yours? Wednesday. Wednesday? Can we Zoom? Can we do this? Can we see you sure. doing it? Look, leaders lead. I've been talking about the vaccine from day one. And if I, who have dedicated my life for 20 years to science, is not going to get the vaccine, who is? This is something that I have studied. This thing works. And this is the way we're going to get out of this. Somebody like me, just a, a regular citizen. When am I, like June? Uh, no, sooner than that. Probably um, at the end of February, we'll start considering the, the general public. How do you feel when you see people like Offset says publicly, yeah, I'm not getting the vaccine, I don't trust it? It's not helpful, it's hurtful. People will die because of comments like that. And it's like me going and trying to critique rap. What type of credibility would I have? Not much. Just to clarify, these two vaccines are extremely safe. It's new technology, but there is no virus being injected in you. This is a mRNA, which is a code that allows your body to make your protein that is similar to the virus. And so it prepares itself to know how to respond. What percentage do we need vaccinated to, to, to beat this thing back? 70% to start getting what's called herd immunity. The world lost one of the greats from complications of COVID-19. Country legend Charlie Pride passed away Saturday. He was 86. The crooner of Kiss and Angel Good Morning had just performed at the CMAs in Nashville a month ago. It was there he accepted a Lifetime Achievement Award. And fellow star Marin Morris tweeted and then deleted that if this was a result of the CMAs being indoors, we should all be outraged. And now people, of course, are pointing fingers saying it was because of the CMAs. But the CMAs say he was tested before he arrived in Nashville. He was tested when he got there, tested when he got back home and even his people agree with that. Do you think it's a good idea to have any type of award show that's even got any type of indoor activity? With appropriate protocols, things can continue. Having said that, if the current environment shows an increased rate in the public, the potential for a miss increases because lives are at stake. Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.